Okay, first let's go over some wrong ways to use an incentive spirometer. A lot of times if patients haven't been educated properly, they will do what they think you're supposed to do naturally with it by blowing into the device rather than actually inhaling from the device. Another wrong way patients may try to use an incentive spirometer is by quickly inhaling and exhaling off the device like this. Now let's look at the right way to use an incentive spirometer. Okay, first what you want to do is you want to set the goal for the patient with the yellow marker so they know where they need to get whenever using this incentive spirometer. Then you're going to have the patient set up and exhale completely. Then have them seal their mouth around the mouthpiece tightly and they will inhale slowly and deeply, making sure to keep the yellow indicator on the side within normal range. They don't want that little yellow piece to go too high or too low. And as they do this, the piston will rise up and have the patient keep inhaling as deep as possible until they can't inhale anymore. And then they'll need to hold their breath for six seconds and then exhale slowly and allow the piston to fall before repeating again and record the amount that they were able to get on the incentive spirometer. And they will perform this at least 10 times every hour or two while awake. So this is what it looks like in action.